Hi, I'm Prashant. I'm a developer advocate with Facebook. I'm here today with Rajiv Kurian from Cool Iris. Cool Iris has one of the coolest, most beautiful apps I've seen in the App Center, and we thought it'd be a great idea to have them come in and tell us a little bit about what it does. Welcome, Rajiv. Thanks, Prashant. So tell us a little bit about what Cool Iris is and how people use it. Sure. Um, so Cool Iris is the creator of the original Android Gallery app, and uh, last year we launched Cool Iris for iOS, uh, which we think is the best photos app on mobile. Uh, when describing Cool Iris, we really like to talk about three features. Um, all your photos in one place. So uh, Cool Iris lets you pull in different sources in one place. Uh, Facebook, Instagram, Flickr, Picasa, you can see all those photos in one place. Once you have them there, you can uh, see these photos in a very beautiful signature 3D wall interface. And you can also share photos out selectively. So you could choose to share some photos out to all your friends on Facebook, others to maybe only a few friends. So how are you using Facebook in your app today? So Facebook is actually an integral part of the Coolaris experience. We let users sign in with Facebook, and over 50% of our users actually choose that option. Um, we let users share photos out to Facebook, so you could select a bunch of photos, drag them over to Facebook, and they get instantly shared. Um, we let users actually invite friends to the Coolaris experience using the Facebook graph. So you could select a few friends, invite them to a private conversation, and uh, they get an app request. They click on that app request, and they come back to the Coolaris experience. And uh, finally, we let users um, see their newsfeed photos, their timeline photos, and all their fo Facebook albums in Coolaris. Now, in the process of integrating with Facebook, what have you learned? Um, so Facebook kind of talks about this a lot. Um, use all the options available. Try out different layouts. And uh, we actually uh, changed our layout to focus more on the photos, and that improved our CTR a lot. Um, Facebook also has these options like uh, user-generated, um, explicit sharing, and we've actually used those options, and, uh, and uh, photos feature prominently on the user's timeline now, and uh, they get the audience that they deserve. That's fantastic. Now, Cool Iris sends and receives lots of different types of data and makes lots of requests. What tools or libraries are you using that other folks could probably benefit from as well? Sure. So we have a custom backend written in Scala, and uh, we use Netty for the networking layer. Uh, this lets us have a lot of open connections. It's very fast and uh, very efficient. Um, we also have a TCP protocol, um, which is uh, binary, and so it's very efficient. Again, lots of open connections, uh, lots of data flowing in, very efficient. Fantastic. Very well done. It's a beautiful app. Uh, cool Iris is available in App Center today. Uh, thank you very much, Rajiv, and thank you very much for joining us.